So for the Linhard guest lecture, I learned that, you know, for public relations, we have to think about the company or the brand and what makes that brand unique or good. And then she also talked about how to how we always need to be ready to help the company or be proactive. And even though we can't predict what a crisis a company will go through, um, she talked about how we can um, pre-plan certain things and in or something like for just in case situations like like if it's a it's a industrial company you can you can start creating templates communication plans ahead of time and have those ready in case there's an accident in the company or something that could possibly happen in a company because we know there are a crisis that happens regardless we just don't know when it will happen so she talked about how we can always be ahead of our game in in terms of um dealing with crisis for a company uh also i have a certain experience with that like for example in the army we have redrafted templates for you know a soldier's death in combat um any other courses of action that we have to do when it comes to or commu um, communication strategies or plans when it comes to things that we know could happen within our realm so we could use certain things for certain situations and we can always have those pre-ready so that's something that will help us be better at our jobs so and it was also, as she mentioned in the video, we always have to be very truthful and authentic because it helps the company's reputation. So I think that's one of the things that she taught us and she talked about that, you know, it is very helpful for the survivability of the company to actually have those, um, have the truthfulness and the honesty for the company or for the people or the publics. And then um, it also, she also talked about the fact that, you know, a lot of, a lot of companies need public relations because they can't do it on their own. So I think that's something that's very important to consider is knowing that you're there as a public relations expert and you're there to help them. So I think, um, so that's what one thing that I learned about that. Um, Another thing that she gave for the hint for a job to during my few, or if I do end up doing a job search for public relations, um, she talked about how as public relations experts or professional, we have to be always, um, we have to find a way to make ourselves stand out. So I know that one thing that she said that we should do is show the clients that we understand their business, that we know and we did our research or studying about the company that we want to apply for. So they could tell that, you know, I have done my research. I am ready to take the job. Take me as your public relations expert. So it's kind of more like um, knowing that knowing that you are an expert to that field and you being able to show that to your future client, then th that's a better possibility of you getting hired for that job. And it, she also talked about, um, another sh thing she talked about was um, the being optimistic, being resilient, and showing that you are a hard worker. So if you start, you know, job interviews and stuff like that, I think what she trying to tell us is basically do your research ahead of time and learn the, the company that you're applying for or the company that you want to work for so when you have that knowledge you can tell them that you know i'm experienced in this i've seen how to deal with this and i know how i can help you and how i can be very be beneficial for the company and that's one way to make ourselves stand out when it comes to uh, job searching in in the public relations world so i think that's for the guest lecturer that was really very helpful and i like everything that she talked about and it gives me a better insight um so I, i'm really excited about um learning more about public relations